Yeah, that me. But as far as I'm concerned, the process protest started quite peaceful, right? There was about 150 people outside the police station, and they was out there. They was quite patient. All they wanted was a few answers as to what was happening. The police completely ignored them. You know what I mean? Just tre treated them with contempt. And even at that point, they didn't retaliate. And then. A young 16-year-old, approximately, went to approach them just to, again, find out roughly what's going on. And they just took some evasive action by pushing her and then drawing their batons. And that's when the people then started to retaliate. Now, I think in all circumstances, having seen that, most people retaliate. Yes? Now, the police seems to have this contempt for people. And I don't think they necessarily needed to have killed the guy, yeah? Yeah, they had apprehended him, right? They was in control, right? There was no need for them to kill him. There was absolutely none, yeah? So basically, they might be surprised that this has happened, yeah? But they still don't seem to have learned their lesson 30 years ago, approximately, what happened Broadwater Farm and Toxworth and them places, yeah? Now, you cannot keep on oppressing people, right? They talk about Tottenham being bad and things, there's nothing wrong with Tottenham, right? We've got a mixture, right, of people in Tottenham. Everybody in general gets on, yeah? So why are they trying to make it out as if Tottenham, you understand, is, you understand, that sort of hot spot, and you understand, it is that bad? I mean, look today, you can see all different sort of groups or whatever, culture people, yeah? There's nothing that serious in Tottenham, yeah? But like I say, they seems to specifically target Tottenham and places like Brixton, the deprived era where they know predominantly most black people's, you understand, and thing sort of reside, yeah? Well, I sincerely hope that this, today, this event, will sort of make some changes, some progress, yeah? Because this is not just about black people now, because if you can see the thing in the pictures, there's all sort of people, yeah? Yeah? It's not just black people, so they can't use that now as an excuse and say, you know what I mean, black people are retaliating in, you know what I mean, in different ways and things like that. Yeah? So, it's a shame that it's happened the way it's happened, but unfortunately they say you've got to fight fire with fire. Yeah? So I hope that they will stand up and they will see and acknowledge and do something about it. It's as simple as that. Yeah?